Let's see another numerical problem which is based on again evaluation of integrals. The problem is evaluate this given integral cos 2x minus cos 2 alpha upon cos x minus cos alpha. So now I see that we have the formula applicable cos c minus cos d. Either we can do the question by this way or you know again it is cos 2 theta something. If it is cos 2 theta, the formula can be 2 cos square theta minus 1 in terms of cos because the whole question is in cos. So it is upon us how we solve this question. In mathematics, always there are more than one ways to solve a given question. Not always, but specifically, usually. So let's see how to do it with the help of approach that I am teaching you. You can always try the other approach yourself. So the approach that we will be using would be the formula of cos 2 theta. What is it? I say cos 2x is equal to 2 cos square x minus 1 and again cos 2 alpha would be 2 cos square alpha minus 1 but since minus is outside it becomes plus 1. In denominator things don't change it is cos x minus cos alpha and dx as it is. Now you see something can be done. Yes I can cancel minus 1 and plus 1. What is the next step? The next step takes 2 common and it becomes cos square x minus cos square alpha upon cos x minus cos alpha dx. Now again a square minus b square, a square minus b square is what? a minus b, a plus b. So it is a plus b, a minus b. And in the denominator again it is cos x minus cos alpha and here it is dx. Now cancel whatever cancels, I see that these two things cancel, so I am left with 2 integration cos x plus 2 integration cos alpha dx everywhere, that does not change, I hope this is clear. Now what is the integration of cos x? The integration of cos x is simply sin x and what is the integration of cos alpha? Please do not write sin alpha here because cos alpha itself is a constant. It has to come outside of the integral. Then inside would be left as 1 dx whose integration is x plus c would be there. So the answer is obtained. This is a very interesting question. The answer to it is 2 sin x plus 2 cos alpha x plus the constant of integration that is c.